What's up YouTube, Jeff back again from High on Android and DopeTechDaily.com and today we're starting a new series here on the channel mainly aimed at all of you students out there in high school or college that are looking to use your smartphone actually as a tool for you in the classroom. Now as I mentioned in my Q&A video, I'm a professor of mathematics, that is my main day job and researcher of mathematics and I use a lot of math apps as tools for my research and also as things to help me teach in the classroom and things I recommend for my students to use. So I'm gonna start a series where I take a look at some of those apps and how you can use them. So today I wanted to start off with a quick overview of one of my favorite apps to recommend to my students and that is Mathway. So Mathway is an app that you can download on iOS or Android has a lot of great useful tools that you can use to help get your math homework, you know, the answers checked to make sure your solutions are correct, and also give you some hints if you get stuck. So today I just want to give a quick overview. If you guys enjoy the content, let me know. I'll do an in-depth tutorial on how to use Mathway for various types and fields of mathematics. So you see here, let me just zoom in and show you guys the app icon. There's the Mathway app itself. If we click into Mathway, you'll be greeted here with the Mathway screen. You can see right there, it's got various tabs at the top. One of those is your user tab, so you'll want to set up a Mathway account. And if you go into settings, one thing you'll want to do right away is go to the math tab here and change your number of decimal digits to the correct number of decimal digits that your professor or instructor recommends for doing your homework. The other thing you can do if you want is you can change these detail and example difficulties if you have the premium version. So I'm not sponsored by Mathway or any, anything at all, but I'll show you really quick. If you want, you can sign up for $19.99 a month. $79.99 a year, and you get step-by-step -step solutions for everything. You get storage space for all of your problem history. It's available 24-7, and you also get, you know, satisfaction guaranteed, money-back guarantee, all of that sort of stuff. And also, you do have a limited storage history for problems you've done in the past. You can see right here, problems that I've done. So it doesn't store all of your history. I believe it stores maybe the last 10 problems if you don't sign up for premium. But you can see right there some of the problems I've done in sort of preparing for this video. So quickly, you can see across the top just a tour of what they have. You can see we've got basic math across here, pre-algebra, algebra, trigonometry, and if we scroll, pre-calculus, calculus, statistics, finite math, linear algebra, and even chemistry. For those of you taking chemistry, you need to do some molecular you know, mole conversions and those sort of things with Avogadro's number. All of you chemistry students out there know exactly what I'm talking about, or I hope you do, but that's exactly what you can use the app for right there at the top in chemistry. So I'm going to show you a few of the things that I did here in my history. You can see that a few of the problems I've worked on, a few things I did, I solved some trig equations, I plotted a piecewise function, you can find the volume of a right circular cone, you can simplify a rational expression for pre-algebra, can graph a piecewise again. All of these things can be done really quickly. So I'll just show you really quick. For instance, with the cone, if you want to find the volume, it actually shows you a graphical user interface with the cone and you specify the radius and the height and it does all the calculation for you. So the one downside, as you see there, it shows you the volume. It's positive 133.97333 repeating. The downside to this, of course, is that you're not actually going to get the steps unless you pay for the premium, but it is a great way to check your homework if you have you know, some questions about whether or not you did a problem correctly on the homework. You can go right here and check it, no problem. Now, one other thing I want to show with Mathway is it has a great feature over here on the side where you can take a picture of some mathematics. You see right there the camera icon. You can import the mathematics into your actual problem. So I'll quickly show you how this works. I pulled up some math on Wikipedia on my Nexus 6P here. So you can see I've got a formula there. And say I want to import that into Mathway on my Note 5. All I need to do is just align the camera here with the formula. Say x of t is a times b t to the r, t over r. x of t is a. Yeah, and you can see here it made a small typo. It didn't put an r there. It put a 7 instead of r. So that's kind of an unfortunate typo. But it is a great feature to be able to import mathematics. So if you're working on something on your homework, you can take a picture of the page. And then you've got most of the formula there. You might have to make a small edit, like changing that T right there, or changing that 7 to an R in this case. But that's not a huge thing. If you have a really long problem, it definitely ex expedites the process of getting Mathway to check your solution. And I have my calculus students do this all the time, and it works really well for them. So Mathway is a great tool. It's one of the more popular apps 
that I recommend to my students. It's easy to use, has a nice graphical user interface, and you can get a lot of stuff done without having to pay for the full version. So if people are interested in me doing a tutorial on how to use either the Trig, Calculus, Algebra, Stats versions and features of Mathway, then I'll go through those menus more in another video. Otherwise, you guys just let me know your thoughts on the apps in the description. If you have any questions in the comments, I'll be happy to answer those for you guys. I'll also leave a link to download the app on iOS and Android in the description below. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. You can find me writing over at news.highonandroid.com, dopetechdaily.com. Follow me on Twitter and Google Plus at the links in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching.